<laughs> Whoa. What was that? Heimdall? <laughs> what idiots. Oh boy. Oh. If it isn't Queen Mistletoe herself. Hilarious, by the way. Been a while. Heimdall. And you must be the little half breed's father. Lucky day! <laughs> You have a lot to answer for, Sunshine. You too, traitor. Better a traitor than Odin's lapdog. Hmm. <laughs> the burden is mine. I can help. I know. But you are needed elsewhere. He's right, you know. Sizzles wasn't looking so hot last I saw. I know you didn't want this. We know how this ends. See you soon. Well, we both know that's not true. <laughs> but don't worry, Frigg. I'll be coming for you and your brother as soon as I am finished here. Oh, boy. Now, what you got? This guy is pissing me off, man. It's interesting that it has the same theme that Magnum Modi did back in the first game. How'd this happen? Having fun yet? Damn. Ooh. Welp. Oh well, you and me then. Oh. Okay then. Whoa. <laughs> I can see why the half breed is such a pusher. Oh look. Back. Yeah, it is. Oh. oh, you motherfucker. Come on. Fight me. No way. You expect it. Ah. Yeah. What the? I can feel your frustration, you know. It is immensely satisfying. Oh, this prick. What now, brother? The spear remains our best chance. <laughs> Yeah, that's what I thought. The scion of the Aesir brought down by an old geezer's cake. Hey, careful! These are new braces. Oh, this prick. Think of this guy's just a troll. I hate trolls. Come on, then, right here. I'm right here. Ugh. Better hope the rescue is going better than this fight. Oh, ho, ho, we got him. You actually hit me. Slow 
What? I don't remember the last time anyone hit me. Oh, he is bad now, isn't he? Come on, brother. You hit him once. Just gotta find the right thing. <laughs> there we are. Armor fit for a cop. You think you can bring down the Asgard? Maybe not, but I can sure bring down you. Nice try. You know, pain is not as bad as I remember. Slow down. Strike, brother. Fuck. That's all this is. If you attack me from behind, you're dead, you understand me? Wait. What is going on in that empty head? Oh, no, 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 no. You are going to spare me out of pity! <laughs> Let it go, you may live. Is this about the little runt? Uh-oh. Oh, now I am definitely going to cut him. Man. This is your final warning. I don't think a warning is going to cut it. You think you get to just walk away? No. That is not how this works. Oh. That's interesting. You do not get to decide my fate. You are dead, sunshine. Whoa. Whoa. What the fuck? This dude is tough. Don't you know who I am? I am the watchman of the AC, the herald of Ragnarok. Slow it down. I am going to find that little mongrel of yours and beat his face into a pulp. Only one of us is walking away from this. And it's sure as shit will not be you. This guy is... I underestimated him, I will admit. I thought all he had was his pre-cognition. Nice try. Nice try. Mimir! Don't. This isn't who you wanted. 
Oh no. I don't know if we are breaking fate, or fate's breaking us. Heimdall was everything described, a, cru a cruel pompous bully and a formidable foe. His gift of intuition was nothing to be ignored, nor was his unexpected mastery of the Bifrost. When I struck a blow that should have ended the fight, I tried to heed the voice in my head that he was beaten, not worth killing. But Heimdall sensed my pity and it shamed him. His pride was not allowing him to accept my mercy, so in the end I gave him none. It was not my choice, and yet I feel satisfied. Have I proved the wrong no one's wrong, or have I proved them right? <sighs> hmm. Emblem of the Nine Realms increases. Hmm. I'll take that. Since I tend to realm shift whenever I do the L1 triangle stuff. But now I have Galahorn with me. That does not spell good things. Now, let's just hope that Freyr is. Hey, a little help? Ah. At least the rescue's going well. Kratos is really upset, with good reason. I was gonna be like I was hoping Freyr was okay. I'm glad he is. Oh, here we go. Let's help you up, Atreus. We need to get him out of here. I'll cover him, but we can't get through the door. The trap. <laughs> Done so. What's your idea, brother? I guess we gotta fight until he uses his idea. Come on, then. Oh. 
fuck? Go back to Valhalla, you prick. carry you. Up you go, brother. You cannot. Ow, ow, ow. Easy. To me. Follow. We, uh, got company back here. Oh, no. No. <laughs> well, this is interesting. Hey, that works. Damn. Nice job, by the way. Hey, Wait, where's my? You okay? No, just on. Kick. <laughs> All right. We gotta be close, right? On your right. Keep going. We're almost at the river. Oh, goodness. I'm about to hurl. <laughs> go, Kratos, go! Where's the boat? Uh-oh. Let's throw it in the river. Hurry now. That won't hold them for long. Whoa. What the hell is that? They will regroup. We should go. Well, pretty freaking cool. Seeing them together makes me smile. But the rescue went off without a hitch, thankfully. Aside from the death of Heimdall. What are you gonna do, brother?
Damn, dude. I mean, damn, quite the sacrifice. Barely knew the guy, but kudos to him. He'll be fine. I hope. the end of Birger. You think he survived that? He's down there picking the dirt out of his nails with the beast's feathers. We'll see. He... Uh, he has to be. We're almost there, Ingvi. Just hold on a bit longer. I don't suppose I have much of a choice at the moment. Well, we're back. And boiling water, red root and lamb's grass. I know, I know. You think I never staunch a bleeder before? Oh, now don't you go worrying, boss. I didn't go through any of your stuff while you was off being tortured. Ah, damn it, Linda. Easy. Heck, you says to me for? I ain't the one who stuck you like a damn pig. No offense. <laughs> Freya, mind giving her a hand? We're just taking over entirely. Hold still. She'll just get you stable so I can take you to Sindri's house. The rest of my herbs are there. We'll protect the realm in your absence. The four of us. Vanaheim's in good hands. Man, I hope they don't die. Oh, party at Sindri's house, huh? Whoever that is. Your boat. Nope. Your boat. Come on, take it. Sail the skies, sun yourself on its bow. You look like you could use it. Hey! <laughs> These are the ashes of my family, you asshole. <laughs> Damn, that was... What he holds in Galahorn is the Herald of Ragnarok. Whatever it does. I read about it in Odin's library. Supposedly it... Hold it, Treyas. We will discuss in private. How you doing? Doing okay? Seems so. This will be of use. dead good is it look i don't know from faith but i know heimdall was a prize-winning taint stain with the capital stamp if he was gonna hurt your boy it's a good thing he ain't around no more the norns didn't quite see it that way the opinion of them three shut-in spinsters ain't worth a goat fart in a hurricane you did what you did no need to fret about it <laughs> Let's hope that's still the case. <laughs> I'm sorry, Bill. Hmm. is the one who found me wounded in the jungle when I was trying to find my way back here. Watched over me as I slept. I never thanked him. If you want to thank him, don't get captured again. 
I promise, love. Easier said than done, but the uh, sentiment is appreciated. What does that mean? Hook could smell something. It could be important. Maybe we should follow her. Oh boy. Another side quest. Tracks. Halkas. Where are you leading this girl? Well, let's do this and then head back to Sindri's. Go get him. You can head back now, Halka. I'll take it from here. <sighs> Continue the conversation you were having before, please. Damn it. Birger have survived a fall like that. Magic, perhaps. Let's make sure to ask once we've extricated him from this situation. Pretty flying through the sky. Should be easy to find Birger from up here. Why'd everyone sound so scared at this place? Uh, on that note, Dragon! Oh! Oof. How the hell did Atreus survive the fall? Atreus! I'm fine! You? Hmm. Well, How did- you seemed angry. What do you suppose that means? We are going the right way. Where are we anyway? Looks to be the ruins of a once thriving Vanier settlement. What happened? You don't rightly know. More reason to find a way out. Well, here's a gateway. Wherever we are. Let's just, uh... Let's try and find Rieger and then we can go. Wait a second. Isn't that... That signal! Rieger's alive! Not for long if that dragon has its way. It will not. Do you see what I'm seeing? A lightning bolt. Except it's frozen? Like the one made in my fight with Thor. But why would there be one just like it here in Vanaheim? Is that why it feels familiar? You must have fought... Faye. What's that dragon up to? And it's angry. How the hell? Brother does not look interested. Okay, so we gotta kill the dragon. Huh. That growth thingy looks weird. Growth thingy? What growth thingy? This growth thingy? Guess so. Isn't that interesting? What is it? I haven't a clue. Hence the interest. 
Still, crystals are valuable. Perhaps we'll find a use for it. What was that? Speak. The day this valley was destroyed, my spirit was torn, split in two. Part of me, it lies out there with my remains. Perhaps if this brooch was tall with me, it would uncloud my mind. I could find peace. What do you remember of the day you died? Everything is hazy. I remember I was nervous. This brooch. I can propose to my beloved. Please, I beg you. Restore me. Restore my memory. Then I can tell you. Tell you all I know of that day. Your remains. Where are they? I was looking out upon the valley. Then the ground. Shoot. I tried to dodge a pillar as it collapsed. I must not have made it. Well then. Spectre may be able to tell us what happened in this valley, brother. If the Leviathan froze that lightning. You think mother was. You know, here? It means nothing. We do not know that Faye was here. True, but that frozen bolt tells an unfinished story. If we want to know what really happened here, we need to know what that spirit remembers. Hmm. Then we go. Oh boy, I was expecting to make story progress today. I guess we did. But now we're in a completely different place. After getting smacked up by a dragon. At least there's the Dressel Rifts around here that we can use. Well, not use, but take care of. We could always come back later, though. Up through that. Oh, it's you. Boston. Actually, you know what? No. We're going to do this at a later time. Probably off screen or something. I want to continue with the main story. So, we'll get to this later. I wanted to tell you. I read something in Odin's library about what Galahorn is supposed to do. Blown by a god, it sounds through all the realms and harmonizes the space between them. Well, it's somewhere like Tyr's temple, and it would be like opening up all the realm travel towers at once. It's quite a vulnerability. Wonder why he didn't just destroy it. Some artifacts defy destruction. Well, we should make Freya aware of this. She'll take and blow it. Oh, does he now? Yeah. You arrived just in time as well. Speak. The tree has become rather overgrown. And? And if it grows too wildly, the branches risk getting too heavy and falling, which is not ideal considering they hold all the rounds. I am no gardener. What an absolute shock. No, I do not require any horticultural skills from you, but I would ask that you keep an eye open for the stags of the Four Seasons. They normally graze upon the tree and keep it tidy. Unfortunately, Bitter decided it would be funny to trick Arrogant into releasing them. If you happen to find the stags during your travels, I would greatly appreciate assistance in bringing them home. I would have one of my spectral squirrels do it, but they, well, keep eating the feed I give them consequence of it being the most delicious food in all the nine realms, I suppose. Speaking of, here, 
Take some feed. Once you've found a stag, the feed should calm them down. Then one of my spectrals will guide them back here. And, uh, don't eat the feed, please. I will not. Bitterness asked me if I was too chicken to release them. But I am, in fact, not chicken-like whatsoever. So as you can see, I had no choice. Yes, of course. What else could you have done? <sighs> While normally this would be a harmless prank, Fimblewinter prevented the stags from returning. And now they have long since scattered to parts unknown. It was worth it. Now then, any luck finding those lean worms? So were you always a freakishly large immortal squirrel, or...? <laughs> Don't forget handsome. No, I was once a regular squirrel. The same size as these wispy, spectral versions of myself, in fact. I was unremarkable. I stumbled upon the tree near what should have been the end of my life, the victim of a random act of predatory savagery. But the tree... It had other plans for an insignificant creature like me. But I have prattled on for far too long. I will leave you be, Master Kratos. Here's what I Until found. Until we meet again. What a rambunctious bunch. Four out of six, not bad. All right. She's the best. Oh, you're back. The heroes of the hour. This dude's hands fuck. Everything. I mean, when you're ready, I'm not giving orders here, am I? Try to rest, Ingvi. Let the herbs work. Oh, they work? Oh, they, they work very well. Because you make things better. You always <laughs> have. Since... Since we were kids, I find a new way to get into trouble. And you find a way to make it better. Well, that's certainly true. Do you know... <clears throat> do you know we used to leave Vanaheim? Together? When we were young? Not much older than you, to be honest. <laughs> well, you know, she did the leading. I just... tried to keep things fun. <laughs> Leadership. Not really my strong suit, let's be honest. <laughs> really? Your group back in Vanaheim seems pretty devoted. Well... I can inspire people, I guess. Yeah, you get them to see the best in themselves, you know? I don't know if that's leadership. It's more like, um... Like a muse? Wait. Like... Like a what? A muse. Father told me about that. In his homeland, they inspired all kinds of artists. What? I love that. That's a job? Well, why don't we have that? Oh, man. I could totally do that. I think they were all goddesses, though. Well, come on. That's not fair. That's not fair. I, I would be a natural. Oh. What were we talking about? Ingvi, you must rest. You understand? You must. Please, just stop talking. Okay. <coughs> I'm sorry. But someone was gonna fill us in on what happened with Heimdall, right? Is that what's happening? Patience. Jesus Christ. Well, hey, you think Sindri's got any more snacks? Enough. Look at that. <laughs> you really did it. How, in all the nine realms, did you manage to kill Heimdall? I knew our spear would do the trick. Well, happy Ragnarok, everybody. Let's drink. Is it true? Heimdall's dead. I can't believe it. There's no stopping it now. Odin swore peace only so long as you spilled no more Aesir blood. I 
refuse that deal. Yet he honored it. But now... But what? You and I know better than anyone that Odin's promises never last. We have the advantage now. It's time to bring him down. No. None of you understand what's coming. Odin's vengeance will be his only concern. Not his only concern. The mask. Whatever knowledge it unlocks, that's what Odin wants more than anything. If I go back to Asgard, go I can... Go back. Go back. Look. If I can finish what I started there, awaken the mask, get answers, maybe that's our way out of this. But I gotta go soon. Before they figure out what's happened. Atreus, you are home. Do not ask me to put you at risk again. He's at risk where he stands, Kratos. We all are. Anything we do or don't do is dangerous right now. But Odin needs me. He trusts me. I'll be safe there. From a tactical perspective, am I wrong? I don't much like it, but it is our best play. Dividing Odin's focus would buy us time. And give us a pair of eyes in the enemy's inner sanctum. But if there is truly a source of infinite knowledge, you can't let Odin have it. Aye, and once he has what he needs from you, then I lose my leverage. I get it. I'll be smart. Father, I can do this. Remember our promise. You too. You know what you're doing. I do too, Sam. Well, I still want to hear how you did it. You mean how we did it? Ah, uh, you have me. And therein lies a tale. Well, that is where we're stopping for today, ladies, gentlemen, and non binary friends. Next time, I'm going to. Well, off camera, I guess. Pick up where I started with some side quests. Maybe we'll find out more about Faye. Maybe not. Guess we'll find out. If you enjoyed the video, like, comment, and subscribe. Hope you stick around to see more of what I'm making. Be seeing ya.